We catch her sooner or later. Sam's all right. He's a friend. No, a range is always a range. If he catches me, I'll hang. We've got him. We can't go on, Rex. We better wait. Only to their pride. <laughs> <laughs> See you get your cut from the next bounty that we collect. You blasted meddling coyote. You know I hate rangers. He's bound to make a mistake soon. There he goes. Is this yours? Yeah. Since when do you ride Indian saddle? Since I met an Indian who had a horse but didn't have any tobacco. Come on, son. <laughs> hey, you ought to watch where you're going, mister. If you like, I could say, pardon me. <laughs> yeah, start right now. We'd like to hear that. Go on, say it. Oh! <laughs> to try. Well, Ranger, you're darn fortunate. The boys are mad. They've got reason to feel a little upset with you. If you want trouble, friend, you'll get it.
Why didn't you let me kill him? It's the wrong time and place. Don't worry. He'll be alive. You men listen to this. This town is ours this evening. When you just drove a bunch of stubborn mavericks from here down the trail to Pecos, and you've been swallowing prairie dust for 90 days, then it feels good to be back. And you boys have a right to bust out. Yeah! I'll buy you around. And that should start you off on a roaring drunk. Yeah! Yeah! Now all you need is money. Yeah! Yeah! Then let's get moving. Let's put our bellies to the bar and start. I think we ought to pay the boys right here in town. Well, Mr. Anders, I think we ought to do it at home. I'll be branded, Matt. You're beginning to sound like my wife. Always want me to come home. Be reasonable. Uh, it ain't fair on the boys. They need some fun after that drive. Now I got nearly $20,000 in cash. My wife ain't here yet. Until she does come here, let's have a dang good time, eh? It's that difficult getting down. How are you going to get back up? Well, that's what I pay you for, Matt. I'll watch him. Deal. worse than they are. I'm warning you, ma'am. And I'm telling you we're taking him with us. Matt, take that rope away. Sure, I'll take it away, wrapped around his neck. That'll do. I don't want to have to use this. But I will if you force me to. Now order your men back. You ought to be lynched. Hold your ground. You're being a fool, Matt. I suggest you send Matt to Hudson to bring the judge over. I'm holding this man here. I'll see he doesn't get loose. Now move out the way and let us through. Very well. I'll go along with that, but I want the trial today. Matt, get the judge, will you? Joe, let's ride. Ha! Ha! Order. Order in the court. Sit down and shut up. <laughs> Oh. 
Where's the rifle? What rifle, Sam? Then who was it that fired? I don't know. But you're free, aren't you? Get out of here. He'll be more used to us now he's free. It's my neck. It was obviously a mistake to trust you. I should have known the law would stick together. Uh, uh, this wound. Well, Mrs. Endis? It looks good. I hope you're not accusing me of helping Garrett. Sheriff, I'm warning you now. If I should ever find out that you let Garrett escape, I won't rest until you lose that star. You'd better wait until you have the facts, Mrs. Endis. I'm ordering you and your men to stay out of this, you hear? And just so that you don't misunderstand. Is this your kind of justice, Sheriff? I want that man found. I thought I'd put a reward out for him. Reward? Yeah, a thousand dollars. Hell, that's chicken feed. He's worth a whole lot more. Why? Well, a man like that is clever. And I'm willing to bet he's a fast gun. He won't catch so easy. What's your price, stranger? The price? One thousand each. Very well, I agree. But if anything happens to Garrett, there's no deal. I want to watch him hang. I was you, I'd look in the Indian reservation. Pony Hills. There you'll find grass and plenty of water. Thanks a passel, Sheriff. At least now I'll get justice. The Sheriff's right. The reservation's a good hideout. For outlaws, sure, but not for a ranger. There's only one thing he can do. And that's to get to his headquarters in Tucson. I tell you. We can let the law handle this as long as there's justice. But let's not waste any time, boys. Don't worry, Mrs. Enders. You'll get your justice after a few formalities. Do you want an official report, Sheriff? I hope you realize that his capture cost me three good men. It'll all be recorded, Mr. Allen. Vince, get the wagon. I want this over and done with. Hey, come with me. What's the holdup? We're ready, ma'am. You wait here.
And Alan, walk slow. To say I'm sorry is hardly enough, Mr. Garrett. Well, here's your horse, Sam. And this. Keep as a souvenir. Hey, put it on. Put it on, Sam. All right, Bob. It must have been difficult and painful. Huh. It's a trick that was once played on me by a bandit and a crooked hangman. Yeah. Yes, the one who's hanging you is in on it with you. It's very simple. No, it better not. It just might not work twice. There's <laughs> Alan. He got what he deserved. There was the one who killed Miss Anderson. Yeah. Adios. So long, Sam. No.